on. So the first one, um, ladies and gentlemen, as I mentioned, when we're looking through these problems, especially when we're trying to condense, is rewrite everything that's in front as your power. So all of these numbers in front, I can rewrite up there. So I can rewrite this as log base 4 of 27 to the 1 3rd minus parentheses log base 4 of 6 squared minus log base 4 of 81 to the 1 half power. All right. Um, now, obviously, ladies and gentlemen, we could go ahead and condense them, but let's e we can simplify these. We can evaluate them. And please remember, guys, that x to the a over b is equivalent to the b root of x to the a power. So if I have x to the 1 half, that's equivalent to 2 over x to the first, or just the square root of x. If I have x to the 1 third power, that's equivalent to the cube root of x. So understanding those, understanding how to go from rational to radical is very helpful. Also, how to go from radical to rational can be, is important in this, in, this, uh, um, in this chapter as well. So now, the cube root of 20, really 27 to the 1 third power is the same thing as the cube root of 27, meaning what number multiplied by itself three times gives you 27? Three. three. So I can write log base 4 of 3 minus parentheses. Uh, 6 squared is going to be 36 minus this, um, 81 to the 1 half power is the same thing as the square root of 81, which is 9. Okay. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to now continue my condensing. But before I do any other condensing, I want to make sure I apply the rules, uh, sorry, um, apply the order of operations. Meaning I'm going to want to apply my condense, condensing inside the parentheses first. So I'll have log base 4 of 3 minus log base 4 of 36 over 9. Does everybody see the, that? Now, obviously, um, I looked at this and say, can I simplify here in this? And yeah, I can divide a 3 in the top and the bottom, right? So that would become, uh, well, actually, you could actually divide 9, actually, even it goes into there how many times? Four times. So therefore, I can rewrite that. Actually, let's rewrite that. Uh, let's keep that. 36 over 9. Therefore, then this becomes log base 4 of 3 minus log base 4 of 4. Going into our understanding of logarithms, 4 raised to what power gives you 4? 1. So I really have log base 4 of 3 minus 1. And since that is not a logarithm, you can't like do the quotient property again. That is just your final answer. Did you get the answer? You didn't finish the answer. 